And tonight's Health Watch, a new blood test that can detect, that detect cancer is generating a lot of excitement. Researchers say it can pick up cancer years before a person gets sick, sometimes even before a tumor shows up on a scan. CBS 2's Dr. Max Gomez is here to explain. That's right, guys. And the goal here is to find a cancer well before it forms a lump you can feel or see on a scan. Even a small one-centimeter tumor already has tens of millions of cancer cells. These new tests being studied might find cancer much earlier by looking for tumor DNA in the bloodstream. It's been called the holy grail of cancer detection research, a test that can pick up cancer at its earliest stages before symptoms. Now a blood test that detects fragments of DNA shed by cancer cells is being hailed as a step toward that goal. We found that for about 10 cancers that we can in fact see a biologic signal in the bloodstream and we call that a liquid biopsy. Those cancers include breast, colorectal, esophageal, head and neck, liver, lung, lymphoma, multiple myeloma, pancreatic and ovarian cancer. The concept behind a liquid biopsy is that even a tumor that's growing still has many cells that are dying off. Those dead cells spill their DNA into the blood. Super sensitive technology can detect circulating DNA. If it matches known cancer genes or gene fragments, that means there's a malignancy somewhere in the body. Now doctors can begin treatment when the body's tumor load is much smaller. Study author Dr. Eric Klein of the Cleveland Clinic says it's exciting because many of these cancers currently do not have good screening tests. These cancers tend to present with advanced stage disease that are hard to cure and our hope is with these preliminary results that this will be the basis of a blood test that allows us to detect these potentially lethal cancers at a much earlier stage when they're far easier to cure. The liquid biopsy would also reveal the cancer's genetics, which could guide doctors as to which treatments might be most effective. Now, these tests are still in the research stage, and it will probably be five to ten years before they're available. Their first use will likely be early detection of a patient's cancer coming back, because doctors would already know what genes to look for from the original cancer surgery. The trick here is to sort out the cancer genetics from all the other DNA that's sure. still floating around in, in the bloodstream. That's what makes it a little bit, a little bit tricky. But they're working on that, and that'll yeah. be a lot easier than having to get scans or biopsies. You bet. Thank Invention. you, Doctor. Thank you. Right.